Hey guys, it's Kelly. Finally um, got a couple charms done. I wanted to show them with you, just a quick share. My beautiful mom was here for the week. She had some um, surgery on her eye and she did fabulous. She actually helped me with these. She it has surgery in her eye, could barely see, but still helped me. She's just the most amazing woman I've ever known. But I made um, a couple charms here, big chunky. This one's really chunky. This is for my mother-in-law and um, she likes teals and blues. I see her wear that a lot. So I put all kinds of charms on here. I didn't do tutorials on them. I've, I've done tutorials on these. They're kind of made the same way, but got some really big beads. These are the beads that I get from Joann's in the strands and they had really good sales this week. So and little charms, cute little charms. Hopefully it's gonna focus here. I just put little dangles on there. Love and a heart locket and a little rhinestone thing. So I used a bunch of the beads that I got from Renye and from Tara. So just showing and this one I got from Tara this little cage I stuck a bead in there some really cool beads I got this one from Fiona Those cute little charms Susan my mother-in-law she's crazy about shoes my husband tells me she helped her move um, several times and went every time she would move she would have like six big huge boxes and it was just her shoes and he always found that just ridiculous you know how men are shoes they just don't understand so there's the one the blue and teal one for my mother-in-law and then his grandma she turns 90 this week and um she likes purple so I made her this one and there's peacock there I love that peacock I think this one was in the, the rack that I got from Renye I believe my mom picked that one out and I didn't see where she got it from and I can't remember because oh my gosh you guys just sent me so many beautiful things I think that one came from Renee, but the peacock just laying over this big bead that's twisted I thought looked really cool. Isn't that cool, that bead? That's really cool. And there's a little angel down there and another love charm. Lots of purple bling. This purple like marbleized one. I really like that bead too. And a dragonfly, a little hat on, a little different one. And then here's a little heart charm, and I hung dangles off of the ends of the hearts. I liked how that came out. I thought that was cute. And this bead is gorgeous, too. Hopefully you guys can see that. It's just beautiful. It comes in the strands that I get from Joann's. And some of these dangles my mom made after her eye surgery. How crazy is that? She made that one. And she's not, you know, she doesn't do this kind of stuff. She was just hanging out with me. We were just giggling and laughing. Making stuff. I like how that one turned out. I think I like this one the best of them. This one feels a little too chunky. Maybe I'll... I might, it's like these big ones are kind of hard to incorporate into it. It's almost better to just take that whole big one out of there. And I might do that. I don't know, guys. Maybe, give me your opinion. If you don't mind, I'm going to take it off. Uh, here, this is what it looks like with it on. Okay. And it's pretty. Dangles nice. But it's it's pretty heavy. It might be a little too chunky because, again, it's it's... I'm giving it to her to put it on her purse and um, you know if it's just gonna be big and weigh her down you know it shouldn't be a nuisance there so I take that one off 
Oh, I forgot my little ring thing. That's all right. So there's just that one charm for that. And I could add these on there somewhere else because I definitely want to put those on there. But that in itself is gorgeous, I think. But here's the charm without that, and I think that's beautiful too. Maybe that's a little, maybe it's a less is more? Or do you guys like it better with all of it on there? I'm just not sure. I always like to add at least one or two of the, you know, really good decorative type beads, you know? And this one is really unique. I really like how that one turned out too. So what do you guys think? With or without this? With or without this one? I can add these little, I definitely want to have the dragonfly on there. So, if you have time, I'd appreciate it. Comment and let me know what you think. Alright, thanks for watching guys. Hope you're all doing well. And I've got other projects that I will be um, bringing on shortly. Thanks.